I've got this feeling I'm feeling you could be the one I see no reason Why I should ever let you go mm. Don't wanna wake up If I'm dreaming Because you know I can't get enough Of this feeling you're giving me Don't wanna wake up Without my channel and if you're new welcome my name's Lisa today's reaction video is going to be a Morissette Amon reaction this is a live performance on mix of her cover of the song nothing's gonna stop us now by Starship it was originally a, an 80s like power ballad rocky song <laughs> from the 80s really looking forward to getting to this one and seeing how she sings this because it was kind of like her um, I think if I remember correctly I haven't listened to it in a while I think it was a duet so there was a, a man and a woman singing um, so it'll be really interesting to see how she does this one. The video that I'm going to watch um, appears to be just her on her own, but I don't know whether there are, um, is another video of maybe her doing a duet with somebody. I'm not too sure, but I'm going to react to this one. And then if you want to see me react to her version of it done as a duet, if there is one out there with somebody else, then obviously please let me know in the comments section. And I will do that at some point as well. But for now, we're just doing the mix live performance. So without further ado, let's get into it and see what Ms. Morissette has for us. Here we go. Oh, love the blue lights, blue and gold. Iconic song, I love this song. Oh, that smile is everything. Looking in your eyes, I see Ooh. a paradise. This world that I found is too good to be true. Standing here beside you, want so much to give you this love in my heart that I'm feeling for you. Let them say we're crazy. Ooh, love Don't that. care about that Cause you had in my hand, baby Don't ever look back Let the world around us Just Oh, I just want to pause it there just to give my first impressions. Oh my gosh. First of all, she looks absolutely stunning. I'm loving what she's wearing, the way she has her hair. She just looks so smiley and happy up there. <laughs> she's beautiful. She really is. Every single time um, I see her, I just think how gorgeous she is. She's, she's just, just stunning. I love the staging and the lighting with the blue and the, the soft sort of golden white lights. Um, perfect setting for that. You know, it doesn't doesn't um it's just just enough of a setting that it sort of you know just adds like that feel to the song and at the same time it doesn't take anything away from her vocal performance um the band are doing an incredible job i always want to give props to the band because um they're just amazing the, the musicians and the backing singers as well they sound awesome um yeah they're doing a brilliant job love this arrangement um so yeah she's she's doing an incredible job i'm loving those like, vocal growls and the cries and like, the voice cracks and stuff that uh, that she she always does so well just love her voice oh my gosh she's just amazing I have a feeling she's gonna do a couple of big things in this song because it is like I say an epic ballad it's like an epic sort of rocky um, it, it, it's just iconic isn't it <laughs> um, so uh, yeah it'd be interesting to see like where she where she takes the song is she gonna do 
do something crazy. <laughs> so let's carry on and uh, see what else she does. That was absolutely incredible. Yeah, props to the backing singers as well for providing those backing vocals and, and just just really kind of adding that extra meat to it. Um, yeah, I mean, backing, backing singers um, don't always get the credit I think they deserve. And there is so much more, I think, to being a backing singer than just literally being at the back and just sort of filling in little gaps for the main singer, for the lead singer. Um, yeah they're definitely underrated <laughs> um, and the same with the musicians as well with the band uh, they did an incredible job i love that whole arrangement and just uh, just staying true to the original but also adding her own little twists and, and changes to it to make it her own to make it very morissette <laughs> with those uh you know vocal growls and the, the voice cracks and a few little vocal variations there and just beautiful job she did she did an incredible job um, I mean, I think that's a perfect song for her voice, to be honest. Um, she really, really did that justice. And uh, yeah, I, I, you could tell she was just so happy up there singing that song. Like, that was a lot of fun for her. <laughs> maybe it's a personal favourite of her and hence why maybe she wanted to cover it. But yeah, a brilliant job. Absolutely loved it. Like I say, the, the setting, the, the staging was just right. It wasn't too much, not too little. It was just, just perfect so that it didn't take away from the vocals and the whole arrangement. Um, yeah, it was just enough. It was eye-catching, but yeah, not too much <laughs> that it's a distraction. And I love that when singers and you know performers can get it right, um, they can get things like that perfectly. It makes all the difference to their performance, I believe. Um, so yeah, loved this, thought it was awesome. So if you enjoyed this too, guys, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to keep up with more Morissette Amon reactions coming very soon, hopefully. <laughs> I'll try not to leave it for too long. <laughs> and also reactions to other various artists on Thursdays and Sundays. And also if you're a Home Free fan and you want to check out my reactions to Home Free music, then please come on back for Home Free Fridays every Friday. <laughs> and also Tom McDonald Tuesdays as well, which will be going for a couple more weeks yet yeah, uh, before I sort of finally close that little chapter that little mini series but I do have a playlist on the channel so if you want to check out my other previous reactions to Tom McDonald's music 
and uh, and see what all that's about then please uh, check out the playlist on the channel and come over for the next couple of weeks for Tom on the Tuesday where I'll be reacting to just a few more tracks of his before I finish that one it's by no means the end of Tom McDonald reactions it's just that I've sort of come to the end of the catalogue now where I've reacted to most of his music so I'll just be um, incorporating that in my regular reactions um, after after that little mini series is done um, because I've sort of pretty much come to the, his more recent stuff now so um, yeah I will definitely still be reacting to Tom McDonald stuff so don't worry <laughs> and I will see you in the next one thanks for watching bye guys for you to change into someone someone who can love me but you play me like there's no tomorrow you should know that I'm fair.